what we see is we all know the internet has changed the world and social media changed the internet and now mobile changes everything. One key difference that happened here is the internet came and things started to change and it seemed pretty, pretty quick but it took a few years. But mobile didn't take a few years. Mobile happened already. It happened like lightning. And, and that's the, the key difference that the world needs to now catch up with. So I think I just skipped a slide. So again, this is not just important to marketers. I think understanding mobile and being able to harness its power is imperative for marketers. So at Colgate, we made mobile a marketing communications priority. In fact, we made mobile a priority, period, to m integrate mobile and to integrate mobile in our campaigns, our marketing campaigns, whether it's mobile ads or video or search or SMS or any of the number of ways to do it. But the idea is to integrate mobile deeply into the campaigns and not to do what I will call mobile drum solos. Some of you may recognize who this drummer is. There's a big clue. It has his name on the drums to see me later if you, if you get that. Um, and we gave everybody in our marketing teams around the world and our agency teams a Colgate mobile playbook that's what to do and how to do it. I can't show you the rest of it, it's a secret, but, but trust me, it's there. And we told everyone around the world to go mobile to make this part of what we do and how do we go to market with consumers. So of course we do it in the US and we do it in China and we even do it in places like India to reach rural consumers using mobile as a primary channel to reach consumers who we can't reach otherwise. But that's what we're doing, but again, we saw that there is this huge gap in mobile marketing, the $20 billion Mary Meeker has up there. So why is there a gap if there's such an incredible opportunity? So I'm on the board of the Mobile Marketing Association, so clearly this is a, a subject that's of great importance to the MMA and its members. So we talk to lots of people, we conduct research to understand why is there a gap in mobile marketing. So I'm not going to present research now, but I'm going to give you a top 10 list, which I think everybody likes top 10 lists, like this one here you can see, of the top 10 reasons and excuses why marketers are not taking advantage of this opportunity. And we hear this all the time. What marketers will say is, I need proof. What's the ROI? My consumers aren't on mobile. I don't believe in mobile. The agency didn't put it in the plan. I can't afford it. I have no reason to change. We tried an app once. We're not going to advertise on a cell phone. And finally, the great one, is it the year of mobile yet? It happened. So what are people saying across the industry? What do they need? Well, I think what we hear from people is they don't know what to do. As marketers, they say, this is complicated. They want measurement. They want proof. So our task in the industry is to educate people, to provide measurement, to prove results, to define the ROI, to simplify, to make it easy, to set standards. But listening again, what are they really, really saying behind that? Because I think in life people do what they really want to do. So the question is, do they want to? Are they inspired? So our task beyond education is to inspire marketers and to inspire our agencies. And a special note to the agencies, I've been a client so long I have to immediately blame everything on the agencies first, but I think the agencies are critical to making mobile happen in marketing and advertising. So the question is when you look at an agency, do they have the capability because they really need to? My, my observation is the media agencies are all over it and there are some terrific specialist mobile agencies around that, that people use. But marketers don't necessarily want to have another agency for every channel, right? So the real, the, the critical thing is that the ad agencies have to include mobile in the campaigns. You can't make a campaign without it. In fact, when you, the words that we hear so often, mobile first, imagine if an ad agency that's used to doing TV first, or maybe even digital first, started with mobile first. Well, mobile would certainly happen appropriately and it would sweep all the digital and traditional channels along with it, but making sure that mobile works in the plan.